welcome back to my channel i cannot believe i'm filming a video like this i think i'd be filming a video like this for a very long time but um here we are and here comes daisy <laughs> um the kids are playing in the other room and i'm trying to be a little quiet because our house is really small so i'm taking a pregnancy test so obviously that's what the video is called but um the reason i'm taking one um unexpected not planned is because i'm late on my period um a couple days late and i'm not feeling normal like i just don't feel myself and the other day um yesterday i took a pregnancy test um from an amazon one and it was a really faint line but i don't really trust those that much because if you're new here or not new here um i tested negative with my with lila for a very long time and I used the Amazon test for a couple of them and they were always wrong. So I don't really trust them. I have them just because I've had them for years. So they're old. Obviously, since I did see a faint line, I now in my head have been like, well, okay, maybe I am pregnant. So I ran to the store and I grabbed pregnancy tests. I have not taken them yet. I opened them. Um, so I got a first response in clear blue because I'm like freaking out. We were not planning on having another baby anytime soon well i mean we talked about i want a third i wanted a third for a long time and i'm ready whenever tommy is ready but he hasn't really been ready um we did talk about trying this summer like starting trying maybe in a couple months and hope maybe get pregnant sometime this year but definitely have not planned on getting pregnant anytime soon like right now we're in a really house, small house that we're renting that we are not loving and there is literally hardly any space for us so the thought of like even being pregnant in this house kind of gives me a lot of anxiety but i know we're moving soon we're hoping to buy in the fall it's just we have a lot going on and i just have this like feeling of not being settled because this house is just not ideal for us and we rented it like sight unseen since we moved out of state uh, but anyway, now I'm rambling about different things, so I don't know. I'm just going to take the test, and we'll see. Ah, I'm nervous. I'm not going to lie. Obviously, if it's a positive, like, I will be so happy. I mean, truly, I will be just, like, over the moon. Like, I'm even, like, thinking about it, and it makes me, like, so emotional. But... The nervous part of me is just like knowing that like life is not like perfect right now, you know, but I don't know. If anything, I know that I had Ella when life was not perfect to have a baby and she was the biggest blessing of my life. So I know that like my timing is not always, I don't know, I don't know, whatever that saying is, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know what I'm even trying to say right now. I just know that whatever is meant to be will be and so I'm going to take this test and we'll find out together. <laughs> this bathroom is really small so I'm just going to go and take the test and then I'll come back um, and we'll see what it says. First response and if I'm depending on what this it says then I can say the clear blue. Um, so I'll be right back. Okay it's going. Oh my. already there was already the second line before even the first line came up like like that that line popped up before the control line I'm trying to find a place to stand. I'm shocked. Like, that is a really dark line. Like, that's really dark. That's dark. Holy crap, I'm gonna have a third kid. You guys, I, I'm, I'm, like, I don't even know what to say right now. I'm almost like gonna start crying because I'm so excited because I've been wanting to have another baby for so long. Um, 
it's just not something like that was like I felt like we were ready like I've been struggling really bad with anxiety and depression for the last couple of years and so I didn't want to like bring a baby into the world and I could like hardly take care of myself but like lately I've been feeling pretty good like I, I mean the last year I've really like come out of it um obviously some days are harder and we were not planning on this right now, so I'm like freaking out that Tommy's gonna freak out. Obviously, baby is a blessing and I know he'll be excited. I'm on my phone right now, so I don't know where to look, but I'm so excited. I cannot believe this says I can't believe it, you guys. I can't believe it. Sorry this video is all over the place. My camera like just decided to stop recording a bit later, but I wanted to finish. Um, this video and I had a little bit to process, a little bit of time to process everything and I'm still in complete shock but I'm so excited you guys um a little nervous because like I, I don't know if I said this or not I can't remember but you know we're living in this small rental house and life is just not like we cannot fit another baby in here which is fine because we're moving in a few months but still just we're all a little stressed in this house and there's other things going on um that maybe make it not the most ideal time but it doesn't really matter because like it's gonna be fine this baby is a blessing this pregnancy is a blessing and I feel grateful and just so excited to be able to have another baby I feel grateful and so excited and blessed and just I don't know like my heart is just so happy because this has been like literally a desire of my heart for a while I just, just knew the timing wasn't great so we've just been talking about it for near future and I'm just so excited because every time I see a baby or I'm talking quiet because the kids are in the room I don't really want them to hear me but um because obviously I don't know <laughs> um but every time I see a pregnant lady or um, a baby, like I just I'm like I'm not ready to close that chapter yet. I feel like I was meant to have at least one more. Like I want to see Lila be a big sister so bad. I want to see the girls together be big sisters together. Have Ella teach her like how to be a big sister and like see Ella as an older kid as a big sister. Like I just picture it all the time. And not to mention the kids talk about it all the time. Like they pretend like they're pregnant. They put like little babies in their bellies and they talk about having a new baby all the time. I'm so excited. Like it doesn't feel real and I don't know when it will. Maybe when I tell Tommy and like go to the doctor. Right now it's just like, right now it's just obviously seeing that positive test. I took quite a few. Um, I don't know. I'm excited to document this journey. I had so much fun documenting like the ha later half of my pregnancy with Lila. Like I, that's when I started YouTube. And it was right there. Okay, I have to wrap this up because the kids are like trying to listen in. <laughs> so, um, thank you so much for watching. I cannot believe I'm gonna have another baby. What? so excited I don't know why I always do this in my arms my kids do it too but thank you for watching um and I can't wait to document this journey it's it's gonna be fun especially with having two kids already I, and they're a little bit older so like they can kind of experience it with me and I'm so excited about that so thank you for watching again subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in my next one bye set my world on fire I just want to love you, just want to hold you Just want to be with you till we grow old Please tell me you'll stay or take me away I want you for myself every single day You set my world on fire You set my Without you, you make me 
smile, what is it that you do? My life was great till 